building towards the time when right now we're going to start talking about the, what kinds of things you can do, right? Uh, um, don't just, okay, supposing we want, supposing, uh, so I'm just saying, supposing we want to start every week, uh, or let's not talk about, let's talk about term one, week one, or term two, week three, or whatever. Uh. Supposing you want to start, supposing you want to start in term one, week three, just supposing, uh, okay? We should not, we should not plan, we should not plan it such that term one, week three already start, start, start the, start the proper lesson in second life, no? The so called proper lesson in second life. We should not criticize that we start first. But, and it, so there should be some lead time, there should be some lead time, say, say the whole of the week, for example, uh, you know, just maybe like what, two or, one or two hours. Lah. Um, again, I'm addressing primarily you because the others have heard the story. The reason is because um, if we just start straight away, um, I'm not even talking about orientation, I'm not even talking about technical skills. They will get so distracted by the uh, maybe how people you stay uh how people despite I think you can comment, just say, say I'm trying okay, to distribute. Yeah, I'm trying to distribute. The children are so excited by the novelty of it all. So you want them to play around with it so that they can actually like uh, play with the hair, with the whatever, you know, that they want to change in the avatar so that they will get over it and then they can focus on the mm. topic when they start the actual yeah. proper. We want to get them walk, walk out the novelty. Walk out the novelty. The novelty effect must be one of them. Just a, just a, some, just a, allow me a moment. Yeah. In case anyone has any doubts about the strength of this novelty effect, a number of years ago, I did a workshop for school leaders and principals in Second Life. And when you said these school leaders and principals in Second Life lose, uh, lose in the virtual environment, it turns out that the first thing that a lot of them try to do is to dye their hair pink with spikes or to take off their clothes. The same as the children, Yes. <laughs> so uh, I, I won't say which uh, principals of which schools did that, yeah. okay? But uh, yes, the novelty effect is very strong. <laughs> No, 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 how can uh, EE actually uh, complement? Yeah, because right now they don't know what you've done, see? Oh, okay. Only we know what you've done, but they don't know what you've done, which I haven't done that point yet. You can see my brain is just, um, you can see how my brain is. Uh. So the two things I wanted to say, Matthew, you have one of the things. The second thing that I wanted to say is uh, that, uh, yeah, okay, uh, it's a, I'm going to use the word blended learning. I don't like this word blended, mm -hmm. but I'm going to use the word blended learning because mm -hmm. I think we have a a uh, common understanding of roughly what blended learning is. Um, one thing that I would, especially for the newbie teachers, such as uh, Rahima and Rani, as well as for the for for for, for Bedok Green as well, um, um, we J Jimmy knows, Clara knows, Habiba knows that the way we do it in job uh, and the way we find it successful in job is not to see the last thing that I want to do uh, is for the students to go, or the teachers worse still. For the teachers to go and communicate to the students the idea that okay class today we are going to do a second life lesson so let's all go to the computer lab and let's do a second life lesson whatever happens in the second life lesson is divorced from what happened in, in regular classroom the, okay so so how do we get around that how do we get around that mental block because we are after all trooping into a computer lab so so what I always encourage the teachers to do is take is is to have not so they, they have the they, they, they're all seated behind the computer screen. But they also have the textbooks open, they also have the, the worksheets right next to them, so that they are continually mm. making these um, cross medial uh, connections. Okay? Yeah, this is very, very important. Um,